You could put in Rage Thrower. I could. I think that this would be the deck to side it in for, actually. I think so, but I don't think it's really necessary well, either. Actually, no, it's not even. Like, the way you're going to get board sweeps is with Rolling Temblor, and he just dies to Rolling Temblor, but he gives you the triggers on the stack. This so is it's such a pretty hand for Drum Mountain. What a pretty hand. It was foretold, and so <laughs> it came to be. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Oh, man. This oh, is man. the guy. This is the guy that took your Think Twices. Oh, Are you yeah. going to let him take your Think Twices and cast them during the game with you? I mean, because you did. You you literally let it happen. I am so. enraged. Let's see. <laughs> man. Okay. Just, just flashing back a Think Twice without dealing you any damage. That's... How quaint. Silly. How quaint. <laughs> he looks ridiculous. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, what a faux pas. Just play some guys. <laughs> play a crab. What's he doing? Wait, he's a forest now? So maybe he's four color, too. He could be spiders. <clears throat> I don't know. Who even knows? Spider splash white for bonds of faith? What? Like <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. Doesn't want to bonds of faith the crab, it seems. Maybe he's just so hurt he doesn't want to play any more creatures. Actually, at this point, I am really <laughs> afraid of Lost in the Mist. If I play Murder of Crows. Then don't play Murder of Crows. Make him feel silly for keeping yeah, the mana maybe up. I'll just forbid an alchemy. <laughs> like, you don't have to play into counter spells if you don't have to. I mean, yeah, he's on this clock right here. Yeah. It's a crab clock. <laughs> Should have called it whimsical Fortress. kind. Yeah. Should have called it Fortress Ice Clock. Look at him. He's playing a no, Ice look, Catcher's see? Rig. See how unhappy I would have been? You would have been really unhappy. Don't silent departure that, by I the won't. way. won't. That's my secret tip of the day. It's a secret tip. It's not a secret. It is. Dream Twist? Moon Heron? I actually. Mm. I mean, this is just gonna go directly <clears throat> in the graveyard. Or you? Think yeah, but it's it, well, because like you don't have any cards right now, and it mills you. Um, Moon Heron is just gonna come out like later. I guess it's a follow-up. I have two in my <clears throat> hand already. Yeah. And I can ruin a repetition for it if I need to. I don't know. Like I feel like this is just more. Sure. I need the creatures for this to be backing up. You know. Do you want to flash back? Dream Twist end of turn just to ping him? Or no? I could. But just for... Yeah, on the you other probably hand, shouldn't. Uh, yeah, I can't then do, like, whatever damage. <clears throat> I think if I attack and he blocks, I could just kill his guy. That's silly. But, like, you don't want to attack, though, because you just want to block his rig, right? Yeah, but then I could kill his guy. But you also want to play Murder of Crows. Yeah. You can't have infinite mana. Fine. Yeah, I don't need to care about this right now. No. You have a creature bird and a creature crab. Mm hmm. And he's just got construct. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what a loser. I didn't mean that. Giarola, you're not a loser. Well, I mean, he lost the previous game, so... Oh, well, I mean, yeah, well, then I guess in that case he is. I mean, he has literally lost, but who hasn't, really? It's true. Should we hold that against him? I wouldn't. I mean, he could rolling Templar to make him feel awful. I don't think I even... But, like, why would you... Yeah, yeah, like, why would you do that? You can't... <laughs> Do you just play a Moon Heron? I think so. I mean, if you wanted to, you could Silent Departure one of his zombies. Yeah, but I... But like, yeah, well, you don't want to no, do that No, I could either. do that. It's not the worst, I just... But, like... It doesn't matter. Yeah. I 
But he can attack you for four. With the zombie. I kind of like that there's different art on the zombie tokens. Yeah, I really like that. I'm glad they brought that back. And I think this is a great application for it. Well, like, yeah, when they because, tried to do it in Homelands, it yeah, didn't make any sense. Exactly. Yeah, but like for tokens, it really does. This doesn't give you any information about the game. Because the only time they can be in play is on the yeah. battlefield. Yeah. I hope he doesn't cast a spell to kill your crab. I hope his spell is flashback moan of the unhallowed. Oh god. It is. He did it. It was. He did it. Oh my god. This is a massacre. <laughs> I don't need to do this now, but I will. <laughs> You're just doing it. Look how little you care. Dude, get a rune catcher's pike. Rune mm. chant. What? Jeez. <laughs> you can't Golly. Heal. I think I discard <clears throat> memory's journey. You don't want to discard your armor scab? I could discard my armor scab. I really could care less about this armor scab. I know. And you don't care about that traveler's amulet. No. Get out of here, traveler's amulet. You Go travel to the graveyard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty pleased with that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> islands, too many islands. Yeah, that might. You can play an island. Yeah, I think it will. Great. I'm glad that you did. Give that fortress crab more of an island home, but not island home. So he's gonna be at seven. I think I just all in him, even though this. Uh, that's kind of greedy. Yeah, just attack with murder and heron. Like, with that one damage is really not gonna... Yeah. <clears throat> you have a burning vengeance, so... Right. Like, he's gonna be have... at seven, and he's gonna be at an odd number, just if I attack with this. So, like, what do I care? Yeah. That seems silly. Like, you have Memory's Journey and Desperate Ravings, and you, the game is over, so... <laughs> <laughs> the draft is over. Okay. <laughs> Good job. All right. 